Hi and welcome back to my channel. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make this simple um, shea butter body cream. Once this um, shea butter body cream comes in contact with your skin, it absorbs immediately. This helps moisturize your skin and retain moisture on your skin and also help in sealing moisture. Let's get started. So to make this simple um, shea butter body cream, I'm going to be using shea butter. Shea butter is very good in the comedogenic rating. Shea butter is zero, meaning shea butter doesn't clog your pores. And that's why I'm using it for this um, tutorial. You can use other butters like cocoa butter, mango butter. So after measuring out my shea butter, the next um, the next step is to put it in a double boiler and allow the shea butter to melt completely into a liquid oil. Then before we start adding other um ingredients so for the ingredient i'm using the oils i'm using i'm using avocado oil and for my avocado oil i'm using 28 grams of avocado oil and avocado oil is good on the skin as well then the next this is the brand that i used you can use any brand of your choice and the next i use is my um castor oil castor butter is also um, helpful on the skin it helps seal in moisture you can use um feel free to choose um whichever oil you want you prefer and for this tutorial these are the oils i'm using that's why i'm mentioning them so at this point i'm measuring out my vitamin e oil with me oil will serve as an antioxidant to this um shea butter light and um, body cream so for the after my shea butter is melted, at this point you can see that it's completely melted. We're just left with the liquid um, shea butter here. So at this point, the next I'm adding my oil, the first oil I'm adding is my castor oil. And for my castor oil, I have 36 grams of castor oil. And I'm going to add it into the, shea, the melted shea butter. And for the shea butter I use, I use um, 130 grams of shea butter. This badge is um, 200 badge size. Then for the avocado oil I use, I use 28 grams of avocado oil. And after adding it, then I added my vitamin e oil. At this point, the oil is cooled down to the point that I can add my um, cool down ingredient to it, which is my vitamin e oil. Like I mentioned earlier, vitamin e oil is an antioxidant um, for this um, shea butter body cream. And so after adding my vitamin e oil, 2 grams of vitamin e oil, and I'm going to, I'm missing it at this point. Once after missing, the next is to add my fragrance oil. Um, here I use um, baby powder fragrance. It smells so good. But remember, shea butter doesn't have a good smell. And that's why I chose this um, fragrance oil, this baby powder fragrance oil. It brings out the, the fragrance very well. And when you apply this shea butter cream on your skin, you don't even notice that you apply shea butter. So here is the brand I used. So at this point, I'm adding my fragrance um, oil into the shea butter body um, cream. I'm going to mix it. And after mixing it, the next is just, remember like I mentioned earlier from the beginning of this um, video, this is very simple to make. If you don't want to go through the stress and hustle of um, melting shea butter, blending, whipping it, whatever, and other formulas. And this is very simple for you. There's no um, much ingredient in this formulation. So... At this point, after adding everything together, the shea butter, castor oil, avocado oil, then here I add, placed it in my fridge because I was I wanted it to solidify faster. And if you don't want that, just leave it in room temperature within five to eight hours, it will solidify. So here is one, one, 30 minutes, one hour after in the fridge. This is the shea butter body cream. Guys, this is so simple. Thank you so much for watching to this point. If you have any questions, don't forget to use the comment section. See you in my next tutorial. Bye.